millions of Canadians look forward to a hot cup of coffee in the morning. But some people take that passion a little further than most. Our Aaron Collins has the story of a Calgary couple who are using their love of coffee to build community and a business. Just how far would you go for the perfect cup of coffee? How about around the world and then out to your backyard? It's a back alley roaster. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so what's a back alley roaster? It means we close the doors when the city comes. <laughs> Sourcing beans from India to Guatemala and roasting them in his garage, an operation that's grown from using just a popcorn maker to a full-size roaster. Yeah, we've sold over a thousand bags now, just in just over a year. A backyard boom of sorts turning a hobby into a business, the Mount Pleasant Roastery. A uniquely 21st century startup deploying an antique printing press to hand mark bags for the beans. But figuring out what to do with all those coffee beans is no easy task. How's the roasting going? Good, we have some done. Oh. I'll put some out front. The answer hanging a little red box outside their inner city Calgary home full of coffee and left unlocked. Neighbors and strangers alike encouraged to help themselves and leave some cash. Yeah, it's the best part about it, actually. The fact that we're trusting people and they are trusting us. So very community oriented. A different way of selling coffee as much about building community as building a business. So far, no thefts, but notes from new customers, new friends left in the box. A testament to their success. Thanks for the coffee. Freshly ground, we're so happy to buy local. Oh, look, Canadian Tire Money, is that what that is? Clearly, business is good, so good, there's a franchise of sorts, a second little red box hung just around the corner from the first. As for future growth, there's plans to make the boxes just a little bit bigger. Aaron Collins, CBC News, Calgary.